Hi you guys, please excuse how ugly I look right now. I just wanted to record a different type of video for you guys. So I wanted to do a kind of what's in my makeup bag video. I have to clean out my makeup bag and put my stuff that I use all the time from here in here just because it's more stuff is accumulated and it's too small and I would just wanted to change a makeup bag so I thought I would record me um, washing the, the brushes and taking stuff out and talking about my favorite beauty products for you guys I thought it might make a relaxing video and some of you might be interested in what I use and yeah um, I'll just set up the camera and show you guys what's in my makeup bag. Okay, you guys. So this is my old makeup bag, the one that I'm currently using. Oh, sorry. It's by Caddy. And yeah, it's a really nice um, material. It's like faux leather, as you can see. I have too much in it, so I just wanted to move my stuff to a bigger one. But yeah, it's really nice. Um, it's really strong and durable. I love the color. Um, and it has these cute little circular um, ends to the zippers. But yeah, catty, catty, catty. And then, oh, there's hair on it, sorry. So I'm just gonna open the front pocket here, as you can see. All my products are like pulling the zipper. I'll just open up this front pocket and show you guys what's in here. So this is a Bare Minerals lip gloss. I love Bare Minerals glosses. If you've seen any of my um makeup videos that I have on my channel. I use these all the time and they're really, really, um, they make your lips look really, really dewy and pretty and full. And they have a cooling effect, like a plumper one, but they're not sticky and they have such pretty colors. This one is in super super sparkly I love their sparkly glosses um, it actually shows up like this on your lips so it's really um, true to color and it's not just like in the bottle it actually looks nice on your lips so yeah in this shade is called I and stuff at the drugstore. Essie lipsticks are really cheap, but they have really nice quality, so it's um, a really nice moisturizing lipstick, but uh, it's not too thin, not too thick. It's really, I've used it a lot, you can tell. It has a little E engraved in the side, but yeah, it's really nice. A oh, nice, pretty shade is called Long Lasting 07. Then I got this Sephora and it's just a little travel mirror. Let's see if I can get it open. Yeah. So it fits my boobs, my tits, and the mirror. Sorry, those lights might be annoying too. <laughs> but yeah, it's um just a Sephora travel mirror and uh, last Christmas I got this 
this um it comes with like Sephora gift cards so that's where I got that then I just have some duo lash glue which I think is the best lash glue <clears throat> I prefer the one that um goes on black and um dries clear this one is white and dry is clear but yeah they're really good really good lash glue um, it really, really makes them stick and, um, kind of pulls it where it's supposed to go. So, I like that stuff a lot. And then I've just got, like, this cheap little brush. I think I got this from the dollar store. Actually, I did, um, if you guys know who She's Lulu is, uh, she made a makeup video and she was talking about the dollar store brushes, how they're really good. or whatever you want to use them for and so yeah I just got that it usually doesn't go there but and as you can see the interior of the makeup bag is like this really cute um Hawaiian flower hibiscus um thick kind of like um, slushy pants material. I guess that's so it can be washed easily. But, and I just got this Marc Jacobs uh, lip gloss. This is a really pretty color. I like the Marc Jacobs lip glosses. Oops. Um, this is just like a premium sample I got from Sephora. And the color is 302. Allow me. sick and yeah it's really long but as you can see I don't have a lot left but it's really good I love it and you get so much it's like a crayon then I got my eyelash curler this is just by I think it's I don't know who it's from or who made it but yeah just my eyelash curler then this is the um, concealer I use. I don't really use concealer a whole lot. Um, I usually just, if I get like acne on my period is when I use it. Um, and this is just the CoverGirl Clean Matte Concealer. It's pretty good, I'd say. Actually, I wouldn't say it's that good. It's really thin. Um, so if you have bad skin or, like, really are into concealer and, like, using it for brightening and highlights, I wouldn't recommend this. But just for, like, a plain Jane, every once in a while concealer, I would recommend it. It's fine. Then I got this stuff, which, okay, the, I love this product, but this isn't my favorite brand, um, or line of this product. 
So this is the Maybelline Tattoo Studio Brow Gel and pretty much what it is is it's just a colored brow gel with um, fibers in it and stuff. The brush looks really bad but so pretty much is you can use this as a substitute to filling in your eyebrows so it like dyes them, makes them look darker and nice and um, thicker and I really like this stuff. This Maybelline one is very good. But there is one by um, Ardell who makes eyelashes and it's really, really good. Um, I really like this type of product if you don't like doing your brows but um, want them to be a bit darker and fuller, I would recommend like a brow gel that's tinted. Then I got this random Kabuki brush. I'm not sure who it's by. But yeah, it's just a Kabuki brush. brush by Real Techniques and Real Techniques is my favorite makeup brush brand. They're really good. I believe they're done by Sam and Nick who are YouTubers. As you can see it's really dirty. I'm gonna wash it in a second. But yeah. Then I got this foundation and this isn't my favorite foundation but I've just been using it a lot because um I want to get um, use it up and it's easy if you just want to slap on some makeup and go. This is the Maybelline Adri Line Eraser Makeup. This used to be popular to review on YouTube. Sorry, mine's really dirty. But, um, yeah, essentially you just wind it up and then put it on your skin and then rub it in. So lazy, I never wash them and my favorites are all dirty. Then I got this Annabelle Unova um, Dark Eyebrow Pencil, which is my favorite pencil. It's a drugstore dupe for a MAC and it's really thin. As you can see, it's really good if you like precise, nice brows, which I do. Then I got the balm, um, Plump. Pucker tinted gloss. This stuff is really good. It's plumping gloss. Oops, I might look in there. It's plumping gloss, so um, it cools your lips and numbs them and makes them look bigger. And it really does work. And the colors are really nice. This is like a pinky coral color. Then I got. Um, this is the MAC Black Track, yeah, Black Track Eyeliner, which is my favorite eyeliner, and it's kind of just like a basic, popular MAC product. Oops. But yeah, it's really good. It's really glossed up. Bottom of the pan. Precise Skin. Um, it's a gel pencil. I'm not sure if it's for your eyebrows or your eyeliner, but it's pretty good. I just don't, it's not my favorite. Then I got this Essence um, Brow Brush, and I use that with the MAC Paint Pot for my eyeliner. Then I got this matte hot, Naughty Matte Lash Mascara, and it has two little things, so you do this step first, and then you open up the bigger one. Oh, sorry guys, it's so tight. Um, and then you open up the bigger one, and yeah, this one goes through the little thing and makes a bigger brush. It's pretty nice. It's nice if you want really separated um, eyelashes. I don't mind it when they're kind of thicker, but this is good if that's what you're after. Then I got a bunch of just like miscellaneous stuff. So, um, a brow brush that's like travel size, uh, wand, baby lips, 
don't you like what one pencil mint gel? It's just a gel eyeliner, a brow brush, and pencil. Then I got a bunch of bobby pins in there, but this is my favorite blush. It's the, the Bomb Frat Boy blush. It has the prettiest pinky um, peach color, and I love that I use that all the time. And then I got this Anastasia Beverly Hills. This was a premium birthday gift from Sephora. It's really good. I don't really like the color, but the... Um, product is really good. Yeah. Okay, you guys, so while my brushes are drying, I'm just gonna put everything back in the new bag. And I'm not gonna do anything, uh, fancy. I'm just gonna, like, pretty much throw everything in there. Make sure it's closed. back in this spot when they're um, dry. So yeah. So I hope you like this video you guys. I'm sorry for how PC I look. I know I need a fake tan. But yeah. I hope you like this video. If you have any comments or requests or recommendations, please leave it in the comments below. And yeah, love you guys. Thank you for watching.